Alright, what is going on dudes? It's your boy Dude76 here and welcome to tutorial on how to buy Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin with 0% fees. That's right, 0.0% fees on an exchange called GDAX, which I'll get to in a minute. And it's very simple, very easy, anybody can do it, your grandma can do it, it's very simple. And um, I know a lot of you guys, obviously, since you clicked on this video, are wanting to invest in cryptocurrency. A huge freeze, a frenzy happening right now. You know, people want to get in and invest. You know, you can make profit. Ten years from now, you're going to be like, oh, I wish I invested in Bitcoin or Ethereum or Litecoin or anything, you know? Just, you're going to do that right now, and it's going to be very simple. Uh, we're going to be using um, Coinbase to open up an account, um, which is the largest exchange in terms of buying and selling Bitcoin with US dollars. So the first thing you want to do is um, head over to this link right here. The link, of course, will be in the description. And then this is a referral link to uh, open up a Coinbase account. So the way this works is if you spend $100 or more on Bitcoin or sell $100 worth or more of Bitcoin, um, you will get a free $10 headed your way. That's right. That's an instant 10% profit right there. You've already made $10. That's 10% right there profit you know just from using this link so um, just you know make sure to enter information your first name last name email a password and then of course enter this all valid as after you make this account you're gonna have to verify it or deposit money so you got to verify that you're 18 and you are say and you are who you say you are so if you're not already 18 you're gonna probably want to ask your parents um, or someone who is 18 to open up an account and then buy Bitcoin that way so make that account and then verify your information through Coinbase and we're actually not going to be using Coinbase to um, you know, buy and sell Bitcoin. We're going to be using something called GDAX, which is from the same company of Coinbase. Uh, Coinbase is just the parent company and GDAX is their exchange. Um, but the main difference is Coinbase charges like a 3%, 4% fee for using their service, which I guess is easy and intuitive, which it is obviously, as it was the number one um, app downloaded on the App Store. Um, but it's charged 3%, which is a lot of money, you know, taking... A hundred dollars, three bucks right there, a thousand dollars, that's thirty bucks. I mean, that's that's a lot of money, you know, especially if you're trading tens of thousands of dollars or millions. It's, it's still money. You don't want to be losing out on money that you could have, right? So you're going to want to have, head over to gdax.com. And then once you're over here, it's the same, again, same company as Coinbase. So just sign up with the same information you made your Coinbase account with. So sign up with Coinbase or uh, GDAX, you know, same thing. And uh, we'll be back in a minute. Okay, so once you've, you know, made your account with Coinbase or GDAX and everything, and you've verified it, right, you're going to have to verify your ID. Um, so you're going to have to send um, them a picture of your photo ID, your, your driver's license, state ID. It's all legit. They're all very, they're the biggest, you know, um, cryptocurrency exchange in the world. So just in terms of buying Bitcoin with US dollars, it's, they're trustworthy. So, you know, trust them. Just, they just have to pr um, know that you're actually who you are and you're 18. It's just legal, just their legal, you know, law and everything. Right, so after that, you're going to visit them with this page. It may seem a little bit daunting at first, but don't worry. I'll explain everything to you. It's actually really simple once you um, play around with it for a few minutes. So, um, yeah, at the top left, you know, GDAX, of course. It shows your Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin. As you can see, Litecoin's a little bit down right now. I hit a huge spike earlier this week. And, you know, you can buy in terms of euros, US dollars, British pounds, or, of course, you can buy with Litecoin, Ethereum, and Bitcoin in exchange between those three cryptocurrencies and then after that you see the order form which shows your balance of trading US dollars with Bitcoin and if you want to deposit money which you obviously want to do in order to uh, buy Bitcoin just click deposit and then you can link your bank account you know at a bank account you know you can do a bank wire transfer which I do not recommend as a $10 wire fee is deducted for all incoming deposits and you can do a Coinbase account again do not recommend because of those three to four percent fees or you could deposit Bitcoin directly using the Bitcoin address. I recommend doing Bake Hunt as uh, there's zero fees and, you know, it's just, you lose out no money. Um, but there is, a, you know, like a three to five business day delay, just, just FYI. So um, you can also withdraw money after you buy or sell Bitcoin. And you can, you know, withdraw it to, again, your bank account. You can bank wire to withdraw, Coinbase account, or B BTC address, you know, just, you can withdraw whatever. And if you actually want to buy um, Ethereum or Litecoin, you're going to want to head over to the you know, Ethereum USD or Litecoin USD tab. In this case, we're going to be buying Bitcoin, but it's up to you. So after that, you know, you have your market limit and stop orders. We'll get to that in a minute. That's how you're actually going to buy Bitcoin with 0% fees. And then you have your order book. So this is showing the um, amount of buy and sell orders, you know, placed right now in a certain amount of range, obviously. And... Orange is the sell orders happening, you know, people are trying to sell Bitcoin and 
green is the uh, buy orders, people don't buy Bitcoin, right? After that, you see your price chart. I recommend using the um, candlestick chart. If you don't know how to read one already, it's pretty simple. I might make a video on it if people request it. Um, candlestick chart, 15 minute um, sections with the EMA 12 and EMA 26 overlays. And just, you know, shows the uh, some very valuable information the candlestick chart does over a line, um, a line chart, which I don't really like. It's just, it just doesn't show enough information in my opinion. Um, and then you have your mid-market price, um, you know, graph right here. There's obviously more sell orders happening right now. You can adjust that, just, you know, to zoom out in terms of, you know, going all the way to $5,000 and, you know, $25,000 off. Um, yeah, so this is your open orders tab right here. This is just showing all the orders you have open right now. Uh, we're going to place one soon. And let's get rid of that. <laughs> they were not buying that much Bitcoin. Um, and then these are your fills or your completed orders. So if you're buying Bitcoin and someone sold it to you, it'll show up here. If you're selling Bitcoin and someone's bought it, it'll show up here. So again, the fills are the same thing as completed orders. And then this right here is a trade history, right? So, the, you know, three minutes ago or two minutes ago, this is happening so often. Uh, the amount of trades in terms of buy themselves in bitcoins right here okay so this is a screenshot from gdex itself you know showing their uh fees in terms of being a maker versus a taker and buying or selling bitcoin uh you can see right here if you're a taker you will pay a fee between 0.1 and 0.25 percent uh, for th uh, for bitcoin and 0.1 and 0.3 percent for ethereum so you're not going to be achieving that 0.1 percent unless you're selling or buying thousands of Bitcoin, which is probably not going to happen. Um, I mean, it could. Like, who knows how rich you guys are? But um, that probably won't happen. You're going to probably be leaning towards the 0.25%. But again, you're still losing money no matter what if you're being the taker. What you want to be is the maker, right? So if another customer places an order that matches yours, you are considered a maker, and your fee will be zero percent. Let me repeat that one more time: zero percent. GDAX will take nothing from you. Your Bitcoin, one dollar of Bitcoin. One dollar of USD, you know, just everything is just flat. You know, there's, there's no fees whatsoever. Okay, so in order to achieve those zero percent fees, you're gonna want to head over to the limit buy and sell portion of GDAX. So uh, just click limit, right, and then hit buy because you're buying Bitcoin. And what I would recommend doing if you want to get your order um, filled as soon as possible, you know, uh, just left click the uh, buy price that is closest to the USD spread. So that's going to be the highest buy price. It'll be filled as soon as possible because the market will fluctuate um, up that or down that if you're selling um, you know, as soon as possible. The quickest is the lowest or highest price. Um, so just left click that and if you want to buy Bitcoin again, just hit the green top most green uh, number. And then if I want to buy all $70.70 worth, that price is a little bit different from earlier you saw, I was just playing around a little bit. Um, just left click that. And that will pre-fill all the um, US dollars you have into Bitcoin. So I'm gonna be buying this much Bitcoin at this price, and it'll t cost me a total of seventy dollars and seventy cents. So just after you've entered all that information, just click place buy order, and there we go. I have an order uh, placed right there for that much Bitcoin at that price with a fee of zero dollars, as you can see. And um, it may take a few minutes for this order to be placed. If it doesn't get placed immediately, just wait a little bit longer, or you can cancel it and uh, retry it again. This may take a few attempts, but trust me, you'll do it. You'll do it in a no matter of, in no matter of time. And um, well, I'll just be returning a few minutes once my order gets filled. Okay, so we're back and my order has been filled, you know, just a few seconds ago. Um, you can see right here, 0 0.0011 Bitcoin at $16,749.98 with a fee of, let's read those zeros, 0 0.000, 0% 000, fees whatsoever that beauty instant um just gratification you know just buying bitcoin with the us dollars it's, it's it should be that simple you know um and as you can see our balance has converted to bitcoin and we we own bitcoin now you know you own bitcoin congratulations if you want to sell your bitcoin say it reaches a million dollars you know um you just want to want to head over to the again limit section and then click sell this time and instead of you know pressing the highest and most number the green section which is the uh, buy orders you're going to want to have to uh, select the lowest portion in the orange section which are the sell orders again closest to the usd spread so just left click that the lowest number to the usd spread in orange just left click it and then i want to sell all my bitcoin just left click that and it'll sell all my Bitcoin and I'll get $17.70 worth because you now the price difference is essentially nothing. Click place sell order and seller's place. If it gets filled, it gets filled. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. 
Uh, you can do the same thing for you know Ethereum and Litecoin, and uh, yeah, you can buy Ethereum and Litecoin with the same uh, way they did it, just doing the limit order by himself. And uh, oh, just just fill it right there. Fill I, I sold it. Now I got I actually lost a penny. Okay, well, I, I didn't do a spell. You, you know what I'm talking about. I just for uh, educational purposes. And um, yeah, you can also day trade. Um, so say. I predict that Bitcoin is going to drop to $10,000. I can set a limit price for $10,000 and uh, sell all my uh, buy Bitcoin um, at $10,000. And and then if I want to sell for, let's say, Bitcoin hits $50,000, I can sell at $50,000, you know? And I'll make a bunch of money, as you can see, all percentages, you know? Um, that's day trading for you right there. Um, or, you know, I guess long-term investment trading, but you could do that daily, just minimal, minimal amounts of difference. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any uh, questions, just make sure to leave them down in the comments below. And, yeah, that's it for me. Thanks for watching. Make sure to rate, comment, subscribe. Next time. All right. La, 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 la,